result of question for one or two persons concerning the preservation of the barley and wheat extract. When we got these items, this is how it comes. You can see that water is dripping from it. We press it down very well. The essence of pressing it down is to preserve it. We now cover it. If we need to take from it, you'll be scraping it little by little. You pour them down into the smaller bucket you want to use. So after doing this this way, we press it down again. By doing this, you can preserve this thing for at least maybe for a week or two. The common ingredient in the production of beer and malt. This is an extract of a soya beans and peel. You see? These are common food items we give our animals anyway. This is PKC, pumpkin cake. The essence of this is to fatten the animal. But if we, if we don't need to put much of this because if you put much of this the result will be that the animal may be may be big but they will have fat in their body and it may not be okay for the health of the animal especially the female ones then we have this this one is called animal complain like uh, the cassava peel, we also have uh, grasses. We already have grass in the bucket, wet. So we mix it with a lemon complain. Mix it together. It will firm up the wheat that is wet already, and it is good for the animal this way because if it is too dry. By the time they are eating it, they will be sniffing the powder, which can give them some respiratory problem. This is PKC. I told you we put in small quantities. We mix PKC and uh, and uh, soya extract now. So this we firm, firm it up because the soya extract and PKC are dry. If you mix it with the wet um, wheat and barley extract, then it will give you a very good combination. We have to measure it in an adequate proportion. This is so eager, and that is very good. It shows that they are healthy animals. While it is not good to starve your animals, because if you starve them, they will not be big. They will not be healthy. At the same time, you don't just give the animals food without um measurement okay this is good for these three animals now you can see the quantity initially when we started this business because we wanted our animals to be big so we just pack food for them at every point in time we stuff them with more than necessary food items they begin to have runny stomach and they defecate so we were advised that we should give them balanced and adequate and that's what we've been following and our animals keep on going very well and healthy you can see that i'm sweating this is very good for for me as an exercise to maintain my balance my body mass index has to be balanced and uh, instead of me to be running around the street i use this as a form of exercise like